All right, I think we are live. I don't know if we are live. I'm using a new, I'm using a new platform, so we'll we'll see how this works. But uh, but it looks like I am live. So welcome to Prosperity Tip number thirty six, and I'm going to be talking about niches today. And and this is a this is a huge topic in the content creation world, affiliate marketing, network marketing. Everyone's always saying, hey, who should I target? Who should my niche be? And it looks like uh, Nick is on here. It says, I am live. I made the, I think I need to make this uh, a little bit bigger font. <laughs> what do you guys think? Uh, because it's uh, it's kind of small, but uh, but it's all good. We will uh, we will roll with uh, with what we're doing here. But, uh, but yeah, actually, I, I think I can. Look at that. I can make it bigger. There you guys, there you guys go. So now I can see your comments a little bit better. But uh, but yeah, so anyway, welcome to the stream. Uh, again, I'm using a new platform, so apologize if, I, if I'm if i messing around with it a little bit more, but I do like to see your guys' comments and, and see you guys on here. So uh, Paul says, sound is so good too. <laughs> okay, cool. Roll with it. Okay, cool. Stream IO, okay, looks great, bro. <laughs> Thanks, Bryce. So cool, this chat works, everything's working. Tyson says, cool. Robert says, hey, Mike. Uh, nice and crisp Ultra HD. Sweet. <laughs> okay. All right. You guys are awesome. Thanks. 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 Cool. So anyway, let's just get right into the topic today. And so everyone always asks, you know, what should I talk about? Who should my niche be? What 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 content or who should I be targeting? And for me, uh, there, and, and this is going to be advice for anyone because for me, I'm at a different level in my business than maybe someone brand new. Uh, someone joins a business and they're like, "Who? Well, who should I? What kind? Con- what kind of content should I create?" Well, picking your niche is is kind of a, a tricky subject because on one hand, the more targeted you are to a specific person, then you can know what problems they have. You could and you can target your content based on that. Like so, for example. When I first got started online, everyone said to target network marketers. Now, the reason they said to target network marketers was because a they already knew the industry, right? They already they weren't gonna say, "Hey, this is a scam," because they've they they've already dealt with that their whole life. Usually, like people who are already in network marketing, so that was kind of the the appeal: target network marketers. But then, if you really think about it. If you target network marketers, what are the what are the problems and struggles that they have? A lot of times they're trying to recruit, they're trying to uh, prospect, right, and and no scripts, those kind of things. So if you want to talk about recruiting, prospecting, scripts, uh, lead generation, those kind of things, if those topics are great for you and you just love doing those topics, then maybe that is a good target market. Also, one crucial thing that I, I, when I go looking in for a target market, one crucial thing I think about is what am I selling? (laughs) Okay. Because if I was selling a weight loss product, then I probably wouldn't want to talk about lead generation all the time, prospecting, recruiting. Uh, I would probably, if you're, you, you can talk about opportunity, right? With, with that, like if you have some kind of network marketing business that's selling a health and wellness product, then maybe in that aspect, it would work. But just think about what you're selling. Cause the, the more far away this, like, so, so for example, like, let's say you were selling a funnel builder tool. Okay. I'll just say, I am, I have a funnel builder tool in my arsenal. Let's say I'm selling a funnel builder tool. Would it make sense for me to start a cooking channel? Maybe. I mean, if I'm if I if I really want to have a hard time selling the funnel builder tool, right? And I'm just like doing cooking channel. I'm I'm doing all this, uh, all these. I'm I'm showing all the pans I'm using. I'm showing all the 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 food that I'm making and all these different things. And then at the end, I'm like, hey, and by the way, if you would like to put your pans on a nice website funnel builder tool, go ahead and go over here, (laughs) right? I don't know. Like it just seems a little off from the target market. Now, if you were, if I was going for opportunity, then maybe that would be an opportunity where I could be like, Hey, I work from home part-time. 
on my spare time, you guys can learn how to make a make an income. You know, when you're not cooking, go over here and 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 check out this business. So in that aspect, I could lead with opportunity if I had a cooking channel. That that is an option, but I prefer to tar my my target market to be people that actually would want the products that I sell. So, and for me, I have a funnel builder tool. I have marketing training and coaching, and I we have a financial literacy product. So, those are the three products that we sell in our company. So, it makes more sense to target people who would need something like that. So, either business owners, affiliate marketers, because I know affiliate marketers they need websites, they need sales, they need leads, they need traffic, they need to convert that traffic into sales. And they also need to be financial, they, they, they wanna be financially fit, right? If you wanna call it like that. Uh, so they, they all need these things. So affiliate marketers was the perfect target market for me personally, because my products serve that market the most. Out of every market that I know of, even, and he, here's the thing, my market technically is not network marketers even though I come from a network marketing background. Now, why is that? Well, a lot of times in network marketing, they're always teaching, keep it simple, use our company replicated website, all these different things. So I actually have a little bit of resistance from network marketers that, that contact me. They're like, well, my company gives me this replica. And I have to sit there and convince them why they shouldn't use their company replicated website. So I'm actually, I have a little bit of resistance when I'm talking to a network marketer because they think that they could just use their company replicated website. Now, can I educate people and show them the way? Yeah, I can. But in my situation, affiliate marketers make more sense because they understand the importance of a website. Every affiliate marketer I know understands the importance of a, a website outside of the company that they give you. So to me, that's a better target market for me, selling a funnel builder tool. Does that make sense, everybody? So, so that's the first step for me. That's that's why I target affiliate marketers. Now, what about you? Here, here's one thing. If you're having a, a struggle, and thank you for all the feedback, guys. I see all these comments. It's really distracting and cool at the same time. But uh, but here is here's some advice if you're struggling with picking who your target market should be. Help the person you used to be. Help the person you used to be. Because if because that is easy. It's so easy to help that person. Why? Because you are that person. You know how you overcame all the challenges and problems that you've gone through in your life. For me, I was in the military getting deployed over and over and over and leaving my family over and over. Uh, and you know, your, your, your wife's at home with the kids by their, by herself, you know, having a birthday, watching your kids grow up. And I'm over here in Iraq guarding a tower right, <laughs> or patrolling on the streets where there's IEDs on the road. Right. And that was not the best situation. I didn't like, I did not like being in that situation at the time. And so I was looking for a way to get out of that. So how do I help that person? That maybe there's someone right now who's deployed and and away from their family. Well, I can talk about that and I can create content on how to do affiliate marketing on the side while you're trying to get out of the military, right? I can I have I can target my market like that if I wanted to. I, I typically don't target military right now at the moment in, in this current part of my life because I, I have affiliate marketers. There's a whole bunch of people who follow me who want to build their own affiliate marketing business. And so that's just an easier market for me to target personally. But if I was struggling with coming up with a topic, who did I, who have I, who was I before and how did I, how can I help that person? So if you were a truck driver, maybe you can talk to truck drivers. If you are, if you went bankrupt, Talk about how you went bankrupt and how you've overcome that, or maybe steps that you've taken to, to further your life, better your life. Uh, if you are a tech person, uh, maybe start a YouTube channel all about tech. 
right? And teach all your little tips and tricks on, on tech stuff. And, and so one of my, my lines, and, and I do a lot of tech stuff. So one thing that I do is I, I just put a little slogan that says, I help, or I help simplify affiliate marketing so that you can generate more traffic leads and sales online. And so when they go to my channel, they'll see me breaking down some of these tools that I use to help with simplifying them, right? Because if I create a tutorial on simplifying some of these tools that we use, well, that's just so much better, right? So, and it just helps them a lot more. So anyway, with that, I hope this helped you, you know, help the person that you used to be, uh, find content that problems that they've had, problems that you, and, and this is why I really love that topic, by the way, is if you've had problems, you could just write down every single problem you've ever had and shoot a video on every single one, how you've overcame it. That, that's perfect content to target that market. And then, and then here's the last tip. It can evolve. You can evolve your target market. You don't have to be lock set on it right now. In fact, just talk about what you want right now. Okay. And then over time, evolve, like change, get the, get narrow down your target market as you go. The, the worst thing that you could ever do is sit there for three weeks coming up with a target market, coming up with a niche. That's the worst thing you can do. Take some action now. Do topics on different things and see which ones that you enjoy. I found that I enjoy doing videos on tech stuff like tools I use. And, and so right now I'm using a new, new tool called Prism Live Studio. And I was just testing it out for the first time today. And so I may do a video on this in my, on my YouTube channel next, right? Because now that I've tested it and I'm going to go back through the replay and see how it showed up. And, and you guys gave me lots of great feedback in the chat here. And so I'm going to probably do a review video on this tool, throw it up on my YouTube channel, target the keywords and get traffic from it. And that's how you do it. So anyway, if you got value from this and you would like more affiliate marketing tips, go ahead and go over to seekprosperity.com forward slash links. And I'll put a link in the description and you'll be able to find all the different resources you need to build your business from home. And so I'm gonna to go to the comments real quick. Uh, I see on the screen, a lot of your comments pop up on the screen, but I also have this cool little chat <laughs> window that shows everybody's comments. So that's pretty cool. Um, so I'm gonna just go through and see if I missed anything good, but let's see. Uh, Mark Harbor says, sup homie. <laughs> What's up, Mark Harbor? Uh, Matthew Martin, nice and crispy ultra. Okay, let's see. And if there's any questions, feel free to type them in there. I just want to make sure I highlight everybody. People that are into some kind of business that need help online or want to get into the online world. Thank you, Nick. What's up, Gregory? Exactly. All right, I'm just going through here. Gregory says, I target affiliate marketers also. That is a great tip. Help the person you once were. Yeah, and, and I'm an affiliate marketer as well, and I've promoted tons of different affiliate products. So I can talk about those problems that I've ran into over time. Makes sense. So that's a great way to target. All right. Last question, last comment here. I just noticed. Hello, sir. Da, 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 da. Let's see. Price lower. <laughs> that's funny. Someone uh, always trying to sp spam the comment. But <laughs> okay, cool. So anyway, thank you guys for showing up. Thank you for being here. Again, go to seekprosperity.com forward slash links if you want more free resources. Make it a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next video.